Ready to Love Season 9, Episode 1. Hey, cousins, I am finally here. I was trying to figure out how I can do Ready to Love. I'm just trying to figure out how, can, how I can do this recording. So, I feel like when I record, when I watch it and then do the reviews, I miss stuff. So I'm trying to figure out how can I do it. So I am watching and re and recording at the same time with my voice only, as you can see, and see if that feels better. You guys, let me know how you feel about it um, in in the comments. But I think this is a, a better way for me. I absolutely love you, love you, love you. Thank you for your love and support. Be sure to subscribe and thumbs up. Uh, I've been up since four trying to record this show. It's now 8.23. I'm having cold symptoms, but I have really bad allergies. So my allergies come off as a cold, but it's not a cold. My doctor had to tell me that because I'm like, why do I keep getting cold? She was like, it's not a cold. It's an allergy. So it's like I have to do two kind of treatments. First, I have to act as if it's a cold, right? Because I have cold symptoms. My throat feels funny. I'm sneezing. Uh, my nose is runny. I'm congested. Those are all cold symptoms. But they can be allergy symptoms for me too. I know it's crazy. So I've taken cold medicine since I've been up. I'm drinking my honey and lemon. So in the next two hours, if I don't feel better, then I'm going to go take two allergy pills. And then there are times that I know it's just allergy because I'm just itching. My throat is itching and, and my eyes are itching and stuff like that. So I know to just go and get the allergy pills. But sometimes it's like a cold symptoms. Oh, girl, cousin, I've just been up all morning. Just like, oh, my God, I want to record ready to love. Anyways, let me know in the comments. Did you watch? What do you think of the cast that we've seen so far? Y'all know how I do my reviews. I am hoping this is a good season. I am just ready for a really good season of Ready to Love. But I will say this. I'm sick and tired of the down south people, okay? Can we bring it up north? Can we come to New York? Can we come to Boston? Okay, New York and New Jersey is the same. So it's not like, you know, can you come to New Jersey? No, it's New York. Okay. Can we, can we bring it back up North? I'm just kind of sick and tired of the down South, people. <laughs> but I love the down South cousin. I absolutely love you and adore it. Please be sure to subscribe. Check out my husband profile. Our husband profile is probably going to start in April. I'm going to do the upload and let y'all know. So y'all could pre-order because y'all want to let go off that taxes money. Y'all are like, cause it's James. I need you to take this tax money before I spend it. So girl, I'm going to help you out. You know, I don't like to hold on to people's money. But girl, since you can't hold on to the money and discipline yourself not to spend the money, girl, I'm going to hold the money for you. <laughs> all right. All right. Let's get into Ready to Love Season 9, Episode 1, Hot and Bothered. Oh, my gosh. Yes. April's 41. Okay. She looks good for 41. She's a pharmaceutical director. Okay. She looks good for 41. She's excited about starting the journey. Oh, she looking for tall, dark, handsome. Lord Jesus, tall, dark, chocolate with great dictation. I love it, girl. Did she say dictation? Yes, I'm going to borrow it. With great dictation. Ooh, child. Should I put that on a shirt? <laughs> Should I put that on a shirt? Great dictation. <laughs> yes. Lord have mercy. Yes, honey. She's a pharmaceutical director, or do you work at the pharmacy, girl? Just tell us. <laughs> She's a great dictation. Tall, dark, and so great dictation. Yes, Lord. Well, she's 41, honey. She's at the peak. She's always on the go. She works really hard and she wanted love. I hope you find it, babes. Who is this little dude here? Who's it?
Laurent is 31. He's a problem. He's not falling in love. He's looking in all the wrong places. <laughs> he don't know where else to look. Oh, I love the suit and I love the shoes, Laurent. System operations manager. What that means? He got to stop going out, build a life, and find a wife. Okay, I like that. I like that, Laurent. Yes, Laura. Who's this? Yes, honey. We could tell she got some work done in the back. Yes, honey. Mika, 36, esthetician. Yes, Mika. Mika got some work done back there. She got two kids. Where's the baby daddy? She's the only one that's not married. <laughs> Laurent talking about he looking for the tequila. They gave him champagne. He looking for the tequila. Ah, that's funny. Okay, brother in blue. Wait a minute. Demonte 42. I love the blue suit, but what's that string hanging off? And why you got sneakers on? He's a fashion stylist. He got on, he got on wedding pants. No, it's not wedding pants. Tuxedo pants, you know, with the line coming down the right. Nope. 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 I don't need to see. And what's up with the sneakers? I don't like that. Sneakers. Come on. That's a nice blue suit. I like that blue suit. But why you got to have sneakers on? <laughs> Uh huh. He said she don't have to dress the best, the best that so he could dress her. So he want people to see their energy. Okay. But why Demonte look like he packing back there? What's going on? Ah! <laughs> Wait a minute. What was that girl's name again? She said when she see Lamonte DeMonte, her mind went to the Nutcracker outfit. Let me rewind. I like the blue. Y'all don't like DeMonte's blue outfit? Or... She said he looked like the Nutcracker. Demika, I got to start. DeMonte comes in. The Nutcracker! <laughs> Wait, I I like oh my god. Do y'all like the Lamontes or Demontes outfit? I cannot be the only one. I like the blue and white. But you know what it is? I love a man in a suit. I love a man in a suit, so I love the outfit. I just don't like the sneakers. And I don't, that chain he got hanging off got to go. I don't like the, um, the tuxedo with the white line on the side. So you are not about to go get married or go to the prom. Please take off the light. I don't like it. Okay. Okay. Oh, by the way, we're only seeing half of them. I think I like the half of them. Um, theme. Do you guys like it? Like we're only seeing ten singles today. I like that. I think I like it because I can get spend more time with them, get to know them more, and so on. Let me know in the comments. Do you like the idea of splitting up the singles? Let me know. Ooh, excuse me. Who is this here showing up in a sweater? I just don't like this. Can you imagine going on a date and he show up looking like that? Looking like the, the like Joseph's coat. I don't like it. I don't like it. Will. What he say? A woman will want to date him because he's Hennessy. Let me rewind, child. You know I got to hear what they say. <clears throat> Hit it on the uh, uh, uh. what he said. I want to hear. Let me turn on. I gotta get my husband to. 
your boy Will. A woman want to date me because I'm in. I got it going on. What he say? Oh, Lord Jesus, where is the where I turn on the words? Where do I turn on the words of what he said? Because he say I'm what handsome. Okay, let's see settings, subtitles. Yes, yes, yes. I need it. I need subtitles. English. Yes, yes. Okay. Okay. Let's see if I get the words. Oh, he, he is some. No, you're not. It's a lie. <laughs> he said a man will want a woman will want to date me because I'm handsome. Lies you told. You ain't handsome. You are right, but you ain't handsome. And then before him greeting the woman, it's your boy Will. Himothy. Oh, he's Himothy. That's cute, Himothy. That's cute. Okay, I don't learn dictation. And I don't learn Himothy. Okay. He got a lot going on. He's smart. He's handsome. He's chocolate. It's like I'm the whole package. Okay. The first shorty that caught his eyes was me. Because you already know, child. I don't want no man that's going to call me no shorty. <laughs> ah, she asked him, why bring you here? He's like, looking, like bring, uh, looking for somebody like you, maybe. Okay, who's this big man here? Oh, his name is William. He said, my name is William. He's 37. He doesn't have a game plan. He's National Guard. He's a stand-up comedian. I just cannot. Wait a minute. He's a comedian, a chef, a protective provider. Wait a minute. Not with them teeth. You can't get me on your side. Your mama should have got you some braces, child. What is going on with that teeth? Them two teeth right there. That's the thing about comedians. They always want to joke. Okay, who's this girl? Who's this? So she's girl in pink is talking about Lamont. Oh, Alexis. Oh, yeah. She's talking about nails clean, smell nice. And she's asking, how did I do? Oh, you have a tickle that you need a pick. You you need a pickle. You have a pickle that needs to be tickled, Alexis. And she said, "I don't care. He dark, tall, short, chocolate, whatever. As long as he tickled my pickle." So Alexis has a pickle that you needs to be tickled, Alexis. Is there something you want to tell us? Because you know, last time we had that girl, we wasn't sure if she was a man or a woman. We still not sure. But anyways, Alexis, go ahead, girl. Oh, she, she, she called. Did she? Is that a purse? What is that? Wait a minute. Does he have a purse? What in the world? Wait a minute. Who is that with the with the little purse? The little pink purse. He's a grown man. Like man. Dominique. Dominique. Never been married. But why you got a pink purse? Don't have any kids. He's an accountant. Oh, Lord, his granddaddy had two, two or three kids and he won two or three kids. So I just can't. Ooh, why is she feeling on that man? I'm very impressed with Dominique. I got very masculine energy. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's, uh, who's this? I gotta get these names. She's impressed with Dominique. She got masculine feelings from him. Mm. Oh, child, he want two to ten kids. No, sir. Can you afford ten kids, Dominique? Is that his name? <laughs> he 
10, 10 kids, you have got to be a multi, in this day and time, you need to be a billionaire to have 10 kids. Okay, nephew Tommy in the in the coffee suit. I like it. I like it. Ooh, Tommy teeth is so white, child. Tommy's teeth is so white, honey. So y'all, I took a break and I just decided to take some allergy pills because I was just sneezing so much and my throat was like on fire and would you know five minutes i'm already better so from now on when i feel like i have a cold i have to tr i have to treat allergy first because like i said my doctor i thought i kept running to the doctor that i had a cold and she was like no you have allergies allergies so my uh 75% of the time, my allergy symptoms shows up like a cold, but it's not a cold, it's allergy. So I've been treating myself for a cold for two days, like a mini cold. And it's allergies. So I just took two allergy pills. I was going to take three, but because I had took that DayQuil earlier this morning, I didn't want to overdo it. So Listen to me. I'm all better. I'm not sneezing. My throat is fine. Isn't that crazy? Anyways, nephew Tommy's here. Nephew Tommy looks so good in his blue, in his brown, coffee brown. Yes, looking for love. Do you want some love? Y'all wondering. Where's the rest of the people? <laughs> Fellas. We're a few ladies short. Five. Where's Glenn? Where's Glenn? Who's Glenn? Glenn is 41. Okay. Glenn is decent looking. Is he drunk? Why well, they ask Glenn if he need a shot? He's an alcoholic, Lord. Never mind. Oh, that's the one with the beard that don't connect. I can't. I cannot. Glenn's got to go. I can't. And why is his lips so pink? Why is the car stop? I cannot with Glenn. You're getting on my nerves already. Oh, I can't. Oh, he's a child. I bet you he's like 21. I can't, Glenn. I just cannot. Glenn is too much. Stop. 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 Child, Glenn don't want to be there. Glenn don't got cold feet. Why is the car backing up? Let me explain to you all why these numbers are the way they are. Okay, the numbers are the way they are because of what? Oh, two mixers. Cool. I like it. But the thing is, are y'all going to cut from the five? Because I don't think five guys is enough because they not one of them there could have got my number. Or a hello. I'm Oh, he's curious about the other woman. Oh, my Lord. Oh, Tanefi Tommy wanted to start the process slow and steady. Yes, Lord. Fire was in your hand. Oh, no, I don't think I don't. Oh, we'll talk about he ain't going to do. I don't think five men is enough. I think nephew time is not doing it right. I think you should do mixer today, mixer together tomorrow, and then a mixer with everybody. And then you vote. <laughs> Tommy know how to do his thing. Indeed. All right, I'm going to hold y'all. I'm going to talk to you for a minute.
Yeah, get the mixer. I don't like none of them. I cannot stand seeing a grown behind me and some earrings. It is such a turn off. Child, if I was there, I would nobody. I would I would just clock out and go home. Fashion show. Oh, he's just talking about his his looks. Oh, his tattoos are significant. I don't want no man with no tattoos. Oh, Lord, he got tattooed, but he don't remember what it is. Koisha. Oh, it's Cousin Nia. Is this the girl you said that reminds you of me, girl? Cousin uh, the Nia, girl, is that the one that got married? And the man had four kids and she didn't know, girl, no, she don't remind you of me. What's going on with Glenn? Ooh, raspberry maple syrup. Ooh, that. April. Oh my God. This dumb dog's going to ask April what she do. He's like, I sell drug. And she's like, that's uh, what's up. Okay, the girl do referee basketball occasion. The girl in the pink. Okay, that's good. Are you ready to be a husband? She's he said I've been ready for three years. She look old though. Koisha. Mm -mm. Oh, she's 35, girl. She was white, raised to be wife, and mom career came after. Okay, so you was mad before. Wait a minute, Koisha. Cornisha, wait a minute. You was raised to be a wife and a mother, but you have two kids. Is that two different baby daddies? And you still want the fairy tale and you still want to have a kid for your husband? But you got two with no husband. And you know we overlook one over here because you know we all young, dumb, do dumb, dumb stuff. But she actually says, I was raised to be a wife and a mother. So what happened? Huh? Is she was she married? Because she said, "I still want the fairy tale of having a baby for my husband," <laughs> which translates to me, her two kids is not from her husband. Is that what y'all getting? Let me know in the comments. Is that what y'all getting? No, I don't want to know nothing other than up to this part. Okay, I don't want no spoiler. Just answer the question up to this point. Is that what you got? Okay. But I'm <laughs> And she 35. Did he say she could squeeze a couple bit more? She was like, squeeze is aggressive. 35, she could have a couple. She could have about two more. She get married and she got two or three more babies. Probably don't want to, but. Oh my God, this fool talk about I love God and I love Buddha too. April says she don't want no more kids or the girl in the brown. Okay. She don't want no more kids. But you see, you see how this guy rolled people with the God talk. We don't know which kind of guy he talking about, Buddha or God. Netflix and Buddha. Will. Will we'll say she's cute. <laughs> Netflix and chill will broke Nicolet. I cannot. Netflix and oh, she coaches a visual. She eat clean. Autoimmune disorder. She's conscious of what she's putting in her body. That's good. Is this Will? Oh no. 
is super diva. Okay. So we say HS for short. She has an autoimmune disease. Remission. Remission. Okay, what's that disorder? I ain't never heard of that. What is what is this autoimmune disease she got? Oh, her body doesn't. Oh, she her body doesn't remove the sweat. Oh wow! So she had to have her sweat gland removed. Oh, girl, you need to perspire. Oh wow! God give his toughest battles to his strongest soldiers. No, God don't give no battle, man. Stop with the lies and the church cliches. I just cannot. Huh? I cannot. The battle has already been won. Oh my God, girl. What's her name? Alexis. Alexis, I don't like you. I will say he wanted to pray for Alexis. She could prove that she can. When you have that autoimmune, that body can't take all that stress. Oh my God, Glenn is too nervous. Ooh, nephew Tommy cut Glenn. Can you imagine a grown viper <laughs> is nervous? The mixer has started. We all get nervous time to time, but this let us know that you are not ready to love. So good. The one guy is cut. They don't need to send any of the men home. Glenn has been cut. What kind of foolishness is this? And then these are the men that want to be your head, want us to submit, want us to respect and honor and adore, but you too nervous to show up to a mixer. I can't. I can't. Stop. 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 <laughs> I just can't. Imagine having a man like Glenn want you to submit to him. But it's, you know what? It's the dumb, dumb woman that married the man like that. Like he a little boy. Like he, he acting like little Michael. Oh, I'm shy. <laughs> he moved to Texas because of COVID. No taxes and looking for a, 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 a wife. <laughs> Lamont, Lamar said, she's real solid and I feel like she'll bake me a pie or something. You're looking a partner he can have fun with, travel with, drink. Drinking and traveling. Koisha, drinking and traveling. Drinking and traveling. Oh, she leaned into him and said, you have a very strong voice. Oh, he asked her if you was leaning in to kiss me. Oh, my Lord. Here she go. When I get close to you, it throws off your guard. I want you to let me in. Pick me, Sha! Pick me, Sha! <laughs> oh, he feel kind of safe with her. He is feminine. <coughs> Lamont, Larar, whatever you name is, you is feminine. <coughs> oh, here go nephew Tommy again. Wait a minute. Well, nephew Tommy's suit will black in one shot and brown in another. <coughs> okay, they're going into the house. You see how Koisha just grabbed onto Laron or Larar or Lamont? But wait a minute. Why is the man sitting on the couch and the woman sitting in the back? Oh, they got a runner. <coughs> this price is not for everybody if you don't show up. But wait, isn't there five guys in the front? 
One, two, three, four, five. So there was going to have six guys. Huh? There's five guys in the front, right? And how many ladies in the back? <clears throat> Let's see. We got to run. One, two, three, four ladies. I don't understand. There's five guys and four ladies, but Glenn is the runner. Explain it to me. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. He didn't show up, girl. Shut your mouth. You, I could tell I'm not going to like her. What's her name, Keisha? Ooh, what you learn to a test. Hot and bother, yes. <clears throat> turn ons and turn offs. You will believe the name on the hat. Turn on and turn off the long too. But wait, why are they still trying to eliminate a guy if Glenn is not there? Glenn is already eliminated. I don't understand, Tommy. Okay. Turn on. Sports certified basketball referee. Watch the sport, Alexis. Alexis, oh my God! Everybody should hold their thing up at the same time. Alexis, Alexis. Uh, uh. <laughs> Okay, turn on. While this mom's closed the door to having any more kids, she's open to dating. The girl in the brown. Who's that, April? Mika, Mika, Mika. Mika, Mika, yeah. <laughs> Lamont said he know Mika didn't want to have more kids. He broke her heart. This one makes every man she goes on a prayer with pray. Koisha. It's Koisha. Koshia. Koisha. That's the Koisha. Koshia. Come on. <laughs> Koshia. Is that why Nia says she reminds you of me? No, girl. She got two babies with no husband. Here we go. Uh, this one's I can't deal. The homeless man's beard. <laughs> it's cold cool shit. Size does matter. Mika. 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 Yes, it does, honey. Don't know women want no damn micro. No chicken leg. Koshia. <laughs> This woman doesn't want any hair down below. Really? Manscaping is important. Dominique and Laron are tied with six. Whichever guy wins. 
Okay, so they're tied. So they got they gotta get a, a an uneven. Final question. <sighs> final question. Final question. What's the final question? Dominique, Laurent, y'all ready? Okay, what's the question? Did Tommy just go on commercial break? Nephew Tommy, you gotta do better. Okay, we're back. Nephew Tommy, playing with my feelings. Okay, so the last question is Dominique and Laurent has six points. What's the tiebreaker? <clears throat> Okay, shut up, Lorada, and let Nephew Tommy ask the question. Turn off. Damn. Ooh, worst date. W wait, worst date. This woman, worst date is celebrity flew her to Atlanta and let her wait in the car until he had a facial. I don't know who that is, but it's either Alexis or. Mika. I don't know. I didn't hear them talk about that, but I'm going with either Alexis or Mika. Let's see who it is. <sighs> and it could be Koisha too, because she's in real estate. Huh. Alexis, Mika, Koisha. It's one of them three. <laughs> okay. Alexis is number one. Koisha is number two, and Meek is number three. Okay, let's see who it is. Alexis, or Laurent has Alexis. Mika. Mika! Yeah, she looked like the type that gets flied out. You see that booty on her? <clears throat> yeah, she's the type that, you know, she get flown flu out. She's that type. <laughs> uh, Koisha wanted uh, Laurent to win and the other two guys, they're not even there. Somebody's going home, and Glenn, it should be Glenn, nephew Tommy. You shouldn't cut anybody else. Okay. Glenn already didn't show up, so he should be the one going home. I'll tell you that, William, honey, William have some baby making hips. <sighs> She's a hooper. I love Alexa's dress. <laughs> Alexa say he like when a man have facial hair. If he don't have facial hair, you shouldn't trust him. I like a nice goatee. I don't like them big old behind ears. Oh, William is asking Alexis, does he date, she date women with kids, men with kids? And she's like, it depends about them. But me too. I don't want no man that had kids. Okay. When, at first I was open if he had one kid, but as I got older, I said, no, I don't want no man with no kids. I don't want to be bothered with no baby mamas and all the money he got is going to be for my children. Y'all delusional woman could be stupid if you want to and be all nice and cute. No, ma'am. I want everything he got is from my kids. Okay? I don't want my kids to share nothing with his other baby mamas and his other children. <sighs> so, William, you got two baby mamas with them baby making hips, child. Three boys? That's a lot. No, he don't need no more kids. Okay, Koisha got divorced in 2018. After I got married, had four children. He was like, hold on, hold on. You date this cat. You get married to this man. 
You did not know he had kids. Yeah, she said, I didn't know he had children at all versus four children. And he said, how was the dingling that good? Thank you. What's his name again? Will, is that Will? Thank you. Sweater. I'm going to call him Sweater until I get the names. No, you're a fool, Koisha. Nia, cousin Nia, I'm going to need you to message me because I don't know how you think me and Koisha is the same. How can we should remind you of me? She talked about she felt really disrespected. How you marry a man with four kids that you didn't know? He got four kids. Now, in 1999, I would give you a pass. But it's social media age. It's 2022, 2023, 2020. How you going to marry a man? Ooh, excuse me, y'all. I'm still drinking my lemon honey tea. Excuse me, saints. How are you going to marry a man? You didn't know he had four kids in this age. You didn't talk to his mama. You didn't talk to his pastor. Uh, you didn't talk to his cousin. You didn't go to his old high school. You didn't search his social media. I don't understand. You didn't talk to none of his friends. You didn't Google him. You need to go on his page and look at all the pictures and look at all the people that like his pictures and like and look at all the people that like that person that like that. I'm trying to understand, Koisha. Why is you disrespecting? You feel disrespected, Koisha, because you know he right. You know he telling you the truth. You's a dumb dumb. You's a fool. Four kids. How you hide four kids? How do you sign on the dotted line and you don't know? Did you look at his tax returns? Did you look at his credit score? Huh? Did you ask him if he had kids? Did you ask for the child support? Did you go down to the court and, and run child support? I'm trying to understand, ma'am. Unless the kids were adopted. If the kids was a I, girl, girl, you delusional. N Cousin Nia, Cousin Nia, I'm going to need you to email me. Oh, you know what? Let me email you right here, girl, because I just can't understand how you go and say, and I felt so good. I was like, for real? And girl went, uh uh, no, no, no. Oing, oing, oing. Let me get Nia. Cousin Nia. I'm going to need you to email me. She said, LOL. Wait a minute. She said, Hi, Cousin Jay. I just watched the clips from the new Ready to Love premiere. And girl, Koisha, remind me of you. The thing she says, I'm like, oh my God, this is Jen. But anyway, uh uh, uh uh. She must have been reading my book and know she's trying to get her life together, honey. For uh uh. <laughs> Message me, boo boo. Message me, girl. Four kids? You didn't know? How? Girl, you's a realtor. No, we don't want to understand. There's no way to un talk about he wasn't there to understand. There is no way to understand you marrying a man that had four kids that you didn't know he had kids. Huh? Girl, bye. I just can't with these delusional women. I uh, see. I don't like her. I, Koisha, I don't like her. She's a dumb dumb. She's like, you can't assume that because of that. And he's like, I understand. And he apologized. And then he said, let's do this. Let's do this. In other words, he's done with her because he's realizing she's a dumb dumb. And he's like, I don't want us to leave the night without exchanging numbers. And she's sipping her drink and looking away, girl. Don't nobody want you. He's the dumb dumb. Okay. They don't want to be bothered with you. Oh, we'll say, I just don't think Koisha's into me. Well, look at her. She he said, even with all the red flags, sure enough, she got a whole lot of red flags. Oh my God, don't tell me we're back to Glenn. Oh, Mika's asking, what's his name if you want to have sex before marriage? Okay. 
She's a well, you know, she's all about the D. <laughs> Personally, she's not gonna do the do. <laughs> I love her braids. I love Mika's braid. Mika said Dominique is standing out. Ooh, Mika gave gave uh, Dominique his number. Child, he can get my number. Mm -mm, I can't. Be too short sure for me. Uh, Wait a Oh my God! He talked about he getting in the dead and taking care of that. Right, right. Um, what's this girl's name with the uh, the 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 pharmacist? Right. At a certain age, we're expecting you to have certain things in order. Okay, you 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 can't be damn there fifty talking about you trying to pay off debt, huh? Trying to get yourself together. No. You just planted the seed that you're working on fixing your credit, right? Oh, she said your personal life is in shambles. Oh, wow. So I learned that you're a comedian. What's the goal there? Oh, I learned that you're a comedian. What's the goal there? <laughs> he said create a legacy and she turned the head and looked at him sideways. Mm. Oh my God. She said, have you started anything yet? He said, I'm working on it. No. Okay, teach you the color to operate firearm. Koisha, I ain't got no nothing you got to say, child. I ain't want to hear it. I want to hear it. These dumb dumb. I don't listen to dumb dumbs. Who owns a gun store? Oh, Tommy's back. Tommy's back. Okay, so Tommy's going to be talking to all the ladies individually. Okay. Non-traditional career. Nope. I need the W-2. I need that every pay week, every two weeks pay. I'm going to need that money. I can't. Maybe if it's going to come, I might get it. I'm going to get it. Nope. I want to know every two weeks that money is going to be in my account. <laughs> okay. I, I don't need to. Uh, I'm going to go, 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 go get it. Uh-uh. I am not of that persuasion. <laughs> Okay, time is talking to all the ladies. Okay. Okay, Koisha is nervous. I love her here though. That's a nice hair style. How's it going? Yeah, they're a lot more relaxed. As you get to know people, you're a lot more relaxed. Yeah, yeah. The, the guys are talking about who going home. Ah, Big Willie say he don't know how he's staying with nobody. I feel like none of the guys should be sent home because Glenn didn't show up. Okay, is that April? She likes Dominique. No, that's not April. Yeah, that is April. Mika said he's a very gentle, calm in spirit. She wants to get to know him. Ah, Alexis picked up that Will. Little Will is a player. 
Koisha likes Laron. Listen to what she said. He allowed me to challenge, challenge his guardedness. Those are words, ladies. We don't use those words. You don't challenge a man. You don't challenge nothing about a man. Nia, I'm going to need you to write me, email me, call me, sis. <laughs> I can't with Koisha. I don't like her. <clears throat> he said April, April and legs. He like legs. <laughs> Kind of connected to who you're not connecting to. Who's turning you off and why? Alexa says, Laron. Laron, Alexa said, Laron is not her cup of tea, not mine either. Didn't I tell you I didn't like Koisha? Didn't I tell you I didn't? I knew she was a get a hood rich. I knew Koisha was getting a hood. Did you hear what she said? At 40 some years old, you're about to snatch up somebody that, girl, let me rewind this. I can't wear her. Didn't I tell y'all I didn't like Koisha? I didn't like her. He's not my cup of tea either. Larisha is going to say, I almost jumped across that table. Hood witch, child. I don't told y'all that Koisha reminds me of Vernisha. Koisha. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry, y'all. Sorry, excuse me. I was drinking my own limited. Koisha, Vernisha. Koisha, Vernisha. <laughs> she said she going to snatch all her curls out. Ooh, get a hood. I told y'all I like her. And she thinks it's cute. She ain't gonna get her no good husband. Koisha look older than her age. 35. She look more like 45. Okay, Mika is not feeling well. Ooh, she said, I don't know why you feel you can touch on me. But, 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 Koisha, you was at the pool touching on Laron. Am I getting the names mixed up? That's crazy to me, Koisha. You don't want Will touching on you, but you was over there touching on Laron at the pool, leaning into him, acting like you's about to kiss him. Make it make sense. It's the double standards I don't like. It's the double standards. Huh? You don't want will touch. Now, you know people. Come on. We talk to people. We know we're touching people. We're going to touch your arm and laugh, girl. <laughs> no. You talk. I don't know why he think he should be touching on me. I don't like her. Oh, no, ma'am. Big Willie been married two times. He ain't no good. Mm -mm. I overlook one, but you'll have to get it right the second time. I'm sorry. Big Willie. Big Willie ain't no good. <sighs> right. He doesn't know how to turn. I tell you, that nephew, Tommy, child. You see that goatee, nephew, Tommy? I just love, oh my God, I just love that goatee. Oh, that's it. That's 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 the type of facial hair I like on the man. I tell that nephew Tommy, honey. Yes, honey. Big Willie don't know how to turn it off. And he's been married twice. No, no. Stop, stop, stop. I can't And then also the whole statement saying what is saying? Right. He just have on the slip on sneaker, right. Right, Alexis. And the sneaker thing, he just looked like he slip on. Okay, those are the little sneakers the kids wear to gym. Like, I totally agree with Alexis. 
in this process, you should present yourself, be presentable. Ooh, Alexis is talking right. <laughs> Went from I want to be an entertainer to now I want to have a gun for black women. <laughs> <laughs> William went from a, from wanting to be a comedian to having a gun, a gun club. William, you are a veteran. You are a, a military guy. Just stick with that. Stick with being the military guy. Stick with being the hero. Stick with being the soldier. Stick with being defending the country. Stick with, I let y'all, y'all feel safe because I'm watching. Stop with it. I want to have a gun show. I'm a cook. I, foolishness. <laughs> foolishness, William. Just stop it. Okay. Just stop. <laughs> oh, I know a guy who know a guy who know a guy. Mm. Oh, she said Demonte is all over the place too. Demonte spoke a lot about himself, right? No stability. Didn't I tell you ain't got no job? Ooh, cha. Don't have a stable job. They don't have a stable job. <laughs> Nephew Tommy says, Thank you for your honesty. It's been real. That is funny. I told y'all these men they have no jobs. Didn't I say y'all? <laughs> I told you that he have no job. Talk about looking for a queen, but you ain't got no stable job. Credit's jacked up. Oh, I just cannot. Yeah, you're going home. You need to go home. You ain't got no job. <laughs> Time is paying for the drinks. That's funny. Okay. Nephew Time is tallying up the votes. Come on, guys. So who's exempt from being eliminated? Laron? Great conversation with all the ladies, Laron, or whatever you're naming the blue suit. Well, you ain't got no job. Ain't no moon. Your credit's jacked up. You shouldn't even want a wife. <sighs> well, I'm ready to go take my nap. They're stressing me out. It's only 10 o'clock and I'm ready to nap. <laughs> And Will Big Willie, you need to go, sir. You've been married twice. You already have three sons. You don't need to get no married. Ah, uh ah, -uh, not Lil Willie acting sweet. Somebody has got to go. Laurent <laughs> said they got him so close to the door. Oh my God, that's fun. Dominique, you are safe. <clears throat> Really proven you got to know these. Oh, Dominique, I just cannot, child. Dominique looks like, like one of my baby brothers. Mm -mm. Who's going to set for Big Willie? No, you don't. You already met her twice. You already had two personal Big Willie. Ain't nobody left out here in this world for you, Big Willie. You got to go on about your business. The one in blue is not ready. He ain't got no job and his credit is jacked up. Demonte, go on. Goodbye. You queen tresses are here. <laughs> yes, I can believe you got rejected. You ain't got no job. <laughs> what, what are you talking about? I got rejected. Can you believe that? Yeah, I can believe it. You ain't got no job. Your credit's jacked up. At this age, you should have your stuff together. I can't wait. The delusional man. I just cannot. Okay, Williams going. Big Willie's going back. Okay, so this is the first of two, Mister. Um, I think I like the the five and five. I think I get to know them a little bit more than have to concentrate on so many people. 
Oh my God, look, Kawisha, I can't wait for Tommy's lunch. I hope that's if you make it to the next round. Oh my God. Oh no, it's the other group that's going to vote. Uh, no. Uh, 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 I don't like Kawisha. I don't told y'all I didn't like her. I knew it. I didn't like her. No, William, ain't no more wives out here. You don't have two wives. You've been married twice. We you don't have two wives. Okay, what's coming up next? This season. Oh, they show what's coming. Oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Okay, okay. No, Mika, why your eyes look like elephant eyes? Okay, what is this guy? What is that stuff in his hair? Look like a whole cane sugar. Well, he needs to just go cut that mess off. Okay, well the thing is I'm not seeing Koisha in these in these shots. Does that mean she she got sent home? Nasty. <laughs> Slow pass. Okay, I don't see Koisha. Does that mean she got sent home? I think they sent Koisha home. Cause we, I don't see her. She needs to be. Oh no, Lord Jesus! Here she goes, sitting at the table. Oh, Tawisha girl, if you got all them dimples in your legs, you should not be wearing no short dresses. Ladies, you got to learn how to dress appropriately. You got all them dimples. We all got a dimple, except for me. Okay, I ain't got no dimples. I'm forty-seven. I ain't got no dimples in my legs. But if you got multiple dimples in your leg, please don't wear them little short dresses that we can see the dimples. Oh, Lord, who's in the bed kissing? It looks like Koisha made it to the end because it's all leg walking with dimples. Oh, Lord, somebody's proposing. I can't, I can't. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Are they going to show us what's coming up next? Oh, no? Okay. All right. Okay, guys. So tell me what you think about this um, episode. I really enjoy it. I'm hoping it's a good season. Leave a comment for me. I'm about to go back to bed and take my nap, my early morning nap. Then I'm going to get up and do some stuff around the house. Okay. Love you, love you, love you. Let me know what you think. Remember to show me love and support. Oh, I forgot to put my banner up. Uh, my cash app is below, but you know what I asked. Pick up a book, give it to somebody, ask them to review it for me. Love you. Or you could get a new email address. It was that email address to buy the book so you could give me the review. Da, girl, you have to think outside the box. Love you. Bye.